talked about it quite a bit here, but I would like to ask you, when it comes to performance, how does Aquila define performance? What does it mean? Well, performance is, um, yeah, it's certainly high speed is not in what we call performance. Um, because, you know, for us, performance is more about the boat has to perform well in rough conditions. So, you know, a lot of guys say, oh, the boat can go 70 miles an hour. Okay, what sort of conditions? You know, it's sort of like, uh, you know, you know, and then even if they come down to 40 miles an hour, there's only one guy enjoying themselves, and that's the guy holding the wheel, and everybody is um, white knuckling it and, you know, right. and, and hanging on for life. So, you know, what is performance? A very good question. And, and, and for me, it's, and, and for Aquila, it's about the boat being comfortable in, you know, in, in roughish conditions and that it performs well and that people on board the boat feel comfortable and good and, you know, they're, they're comfortable. So it's got to perform in various different aspects, the comfort point of view, the sea kindness point of view. Um, obviously, it's got to be really tough. It's got to perform from a structural and safety point of view to the, you know, um, to the best that we can possibly do. So, so for us, that's a, that's a lot about the performance. Then it's, you know, the engine performance, the equipment, generators, whatever that might be, they have to perform well with, we're always looking at weight, trying to balance weight, trying to balance that. But sometimes you have to give up, you know, take extra weight to get that extra reliability. Um, because, you know, going light is, you know, the lighter you can make the boat, obviously the better it's going to be, more efficient it's going to be, but there's, there's a balance. So performance it's of every <clears throat> aspect, performance of the electrical system, you know, we're going more and more to digital switching, C-Zone, we're working with all, all of our new boats, our C-Zone, the 70 C-Zone, the 54, our 32 was C-Zone, um, so every new boat we're going into, so the electrical system has to perform well. So whatever it is, it's, uh, it's right. um, I really it's like your answer. Uh, I really like your answer, though, Lex. You know, sometimes when you ask people about performance, the first thing they want to give you is time to plane and top speed. And you're so right. It's so much more than that, especially to the people that are on a boat. It isn't about yeah, there might be some desire, especially if you're going to do cruising. We want to get as most out of our vacation time as we can. So you know, to run at 20, 25 knots, maybe gives us the, the comfort level we want, but it's so much more than that, right? It's how does the boat perform? How do people feel when the boat's going that speed? How does it hold up over years, especially in a charter environment, uh, which translates, I think you said it very well, if the charter boat holds up very well over 26 weeks of use, in my private use, it's gonna be a fantastic boat and give me two incredible you know, uh, longevity and durability because what kind of time do we put on it there? So great answer. Thank you for that.